Police and members of law enforcement often rely on bulletproof vests while investigating crimes. Now, K-9 officers in the Trumbull County Sheriff's Office have their own protective vests. Lindsay McCoy shows us the donated vests in action and how they'll help in the fight against the drug epidemic. Custom made and fitted, Trumbull County Sheriff K-9 officers are wearing new protective vests on the job. <laughs> You hope you never need it, but you sure are glad you have it. Officers Lincoln and Lord work with the TAG Drug Task Force on the county's drug interdiction team that is trying to stop the flow of opioids and illegal drugs. So these two dogs are out at least twice a week on uh, well-traveled roads that run through Trumbull County that we believe our heavy source of bringing drugs into our area. A grant from the nonprofit Vested Interest paid for the bulletproof and stab proof vests. It's an extra layer of protection just in case they sniff out extra trouble. Their noses are better than our eyes in a lot of ways. Um, with the interdiction program and vehicle traffic stops, that's that's a way for us to obtain a right to search that vehicle if these dogs alert on that vehicle that there's an illegal substance. Right now, the county sheriff says they're keeping their head above water at the jail amid the ongoing epidemic. As far as the opioid epidemic, I believe it's gotten a little bit better. Um, on the downside, the trends in our country, you don't see people wanting to get in law enforcement like they used to. TAG is finding heroin mixed with fentanyl in investigations, along with more meth and crack cocaine, as it's now cheaper on the streets. With more local news, I'm Lindsay McCoy.